Good morning, South Africa. <laughs> I just want to say hello to all of our 19 subscribers. Guys, if you watch this video, uh, just leave a comment below so that uh, we know what you want us to make videos about. Uh, we haven't done any in a long time and um, we're going to start off today with uh, auto pot fittings, yes, how to connect auto pots to tanks basically and then at the end of this video we'll show you something we've been busy with in the showroom. Okay, so flexi tanks. This is a 100 litre flexi tank. It's empty at the moment. We've got to put water in. They come with uh, shuttle valves like this. When you do assemble one, make sure there's no folds in the blue fabric. Otherwise it will like leak water through the seals. Also make sure that you've got a rubber seal, one on each side. Don't put both rubber seals on one side because then it will also leak. From there on, goes to a click and fit, click fit filter, what we call it. This is basically 12 mil local irrigation piping coming down to uh, auto pot connectors. These are T's. On top you'll see the old 5 mil one. On the bottom you'll see the thicker blue uh, what we call 9 mil auto pot piping. And this stuff goes to auto pots. I'm going to show you in a bit a little bit more about options that you have getting from a tank to your auto pots. Okay, so as far as tanks go, you don't have to buy a flexi tank. You can use any kind of container. For instance, these rough totes that you get at any plastics place, or you could use our 47 litre auto pot tanks. Uh, these come with a pre drilled hole through which your grommet will go. Yeah, you just have to drill your own hole. Okay, so we've spoken about the flexi tank tap, which clicks into the click and fit. That's 12 mil piping. South African 12 mil sprinkler pipe from there, right? You can use the more expensive auto pot piping. It's more squishy, although it's much thicker. I don't know if you can see there. This will also fit in there. Uh, you can also use from here on normal hose pipe, the thin one. This will also fit the auto pot connectors. Either one of these three will fit those auto pot connectors. When you're sticking the stuff together, just put this much into basically boiling water and you'll be able to pop it on there easily. Otherwise, you're going to sickle. So from this step, we've got one more type of click fit filter. This one is the 9 mil one. We actually do have one with the old skinny pipe but all the new aqua valves aqua valve 5 5 mil inner diameter they work with this blue pipe so you can do click fit directly to this 9 mil pipe if you want to otherwise we're gonna remove this remove that you can work with the little golf filter which sits on the inside of your tank and that will through the tank wall run a grommet a 9 mil grommet for the 9 mil piping pretty straightforward we do have smaller grommets for your 5 mil piping your old piping if you don't want to use this if you still want to run a little bit of a thicker 12 mil trunk line uh, here you could use either the expensive auto pot piping or the normal south african 12 mil and you would use a 16 mil top head grommet sorry about the focus just not working uh, but this grommet will sit inside your tank you can stick the pipe through there and then from there on out pop your uncle again okay so I've tried to quickly show you 
various types of fittings uh, basically if you're only running one or two up to even four valves you don't really have to have a 12 mil trunk line it's for a little bit larger systems where you're running 8 and 10 and 12 pot sets where you need a thicker trunk line uh, a nice tip is also to at the end of your line install some kind of a, either a valve or an end cap that you can pull out don't stick it all the way in uh, just to flush out your piping once every two months or so just to get some of the gunk that always ends up uh, building up in the lines especially if you're outside uh, just flush all that gunk out every now and again uh, just to keep that clean okay i hope this was a little bit informative uh, please do let us know what else you'd like to see more videos of Thank you.